Good morning again. This is my second video of the day. First one was a little heavy. But like I said, the energy's heavy, vibes are heavy, it blows. But I'm gonna talk to you about something else I was thinking about yesterday. Mental manipulation, mind control, things that you know used to be conspiracy theories. Now the you know comes out the government, the CIA, and all these little pricks have been experimenting with this shit for years. Subtlety, yes, but it could also be subliminal. It could be, it's it's out there, kid. I don't know how to explain it. Let's talk about the the mental manipulation and what they're trying to do with you. It's called it's mind control. It's it's conditioning. They want to condition you to be an unfeeling, unempathetic, empathetic, empathetic human. There's a great movie called Soldier with Kurt Russell in it. The beginning of the movie, they're little, they're little boys, little children, and they're and they're basically grooming them to be killers from day one. So they're teach, they're playing video games, first person shooter games, which is super popular. My son loves it. Hurts my heart to see him playing that shit, but I just I can't. You know, he's gonna be him. He's gonna do him, and I can't. That's not my karma. I can just love him and support him, but I don't buy that shit. I don't believe in. It. I think it's just horrible. That's that's mental conditioning right there. You know, there's one scene where there's one kid that wasn't. They were doing a jog in this movie, and this one kid was a little heavy, and he was falling behind all the other kids. Like he was, you know, he could do the truffle shuffle, right? What happens? They're all jogging, and and he falls behind. A jeep turns around, goes back, and whacks the kid. And all these other kid boys running hear him get shot, and know that's the end of him. So they know in their mind that they got to keep going, and they're gonna get whacked too. Lovely movie. I mean, the movie, the premise of the movie is really, it's 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 about finding humanity again. He ends up, you know, getting disposed of because he's a, you know, they're disposable. And he comes across some people that are colonized this little planet, and they're not scumbags, and they don't. And he doesn't understand about family and connections and love, and so he has to feel all that stuff all over again. Which is, like I said, the movie's a good movie, but right now the the Bill Burgers, the Trilateral Commission, the the powers that be, the globalists, they they want people to hate, they want people to be divided, they want people to get united to see what they're doing to them. Because then they would all be round up quick. And it would be a hot second and it would not be pretty. It would be like the French Revolution on steroids, right? So they're trying to keep everybody in hate. Racism is a great way to do use that tool. That's a great tool for Satan, right? The Dark Lord loves that shit. Let's see how much people we can get them to hate each other because of just because of the way they look. Maybe their hair's different. Maybe their hair's blonde or it's it's dark or it's their skin's super dark or their skin's super dark albino there's there's differences we can use we can divide them ah <sighs> those pricks and it's working unfortunately some parts a lot of time a lot of people don't buy it a lot of people have good hearts and they're they're following their hearts and they're not listening to it and god bless them or you know god earth goddess Gaia bless them, whatever your religion or whatever you believe. Like I tell people, everybody works for the light. You might just call it something different. So don't don't shit on somebody else's religion because you don't buy it. As long as they walk, walk in the light and believe in love and light, then they're working for the they're working for source. They're working for the universe. So don't put them down. That's just it. religion is just another great control mechanism. I've talked about re organized religion ad nauseum, and it's just a control mechanism. That's all it is. They want to control how you feel, how you think, how you believe, and it's bullshit. God wants you to be free. He wants you to love. He wants you to laugh. He doesn't want you to live in fear or run around thinking about other people fearfully. So this is my this is my service for today. Love yourself. Don't fall for the mind control. Put down the third per first person shooter games. I mean, find a different goddamn hobby, people, than killing other human beings for sport. So, that being said, I love you, God loves you, and the universe is still digging you. So have a wonderful day. And so will I.